Can I fight you? I don't hit women, so you win by default, so I will lose. Gain weight to fight Anthony Joshua. Yeah. I will become a heavyweight. So that's the next of your list. I already have my plan for him. He already lost to a smaller guy, Usyk. <laughs> and those are the words of Ryan Garcia as he says he cannot wait to fight Anthony Joshua at heavyweight and he's already beat or been beat by a smaller guy in Usyk. And let me counterpunch. Um, I don't know. This is the second time we've heard Ryan mention AJ, you know, and the thing that sticks out with me with Ryan, you know, we've heard him talk about boots. We've heard him talk about Terrence Crawford, but we haven't heard him talk about anybody at 168, which is Canelo, which was a guy that he's trained with. He ain't talked about him. He ain't talked about Baturviev. He ain't talked about Bivol. He ain't talked about David Benavidez. He ain't talked about none of those guys. And I just find it strange. Why AJ? Why Anthony Joshua? Why from 140, which was his last fight, why would you expect realistically to go from 140 to 220 or to 205? It's just ridiculous. That's 65 pounds that 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 uh, Ryan would have to gain, you know. And you want to blame and you want to bring up AJ. And the only thing that I can counterpunch people and come up with with uh, Ryan saying this is. He knows what type of cheddar that Anthony Joshua was bringing. He knows that a fight like with AJ is a fight that he knows that money can flourish. But then again, if that's the case, what about Canelo Alvarez? Because he is still the cash cow. He is still the highest paid boxer on the landscape right now. So why not talk and bring and mention him out? Because maybe that's something that, that Canelo Alvarez would probably welcome. He would probably welcome a fight like that because, you know, Canelo likes bringing little dudes up and, you know, knocking them out and beating them up and stuff like that. He, I think he gets a kick out of that shit sometimes. I do. I do. I do. But as far as AJ, I just think it's wild. And I think, you know, Ryan should really get his head examined with wanting to fight someone like AJ. And only to say, well, hey, he got beat by a smaller guy. Well, hey, what about the smaller guy? That's the guy that's a champion. Now, he never said that he wanted to be a champion at heavyweight. He just said he wanted to fight Anthony Joshua at heavyweight. So maybe that's somebody on his radar. But I could tell you this, realistically speaking, if Ryan Garcia did gain 100, I mean, 65 pounds to get to heavyweight, okay? Now, remember, we have the bullshit Bridgerweight division. You know what I mean? So that kind of puts a monk in the wrench. But even if he did and he gained enough weight to legitimately challenge someone like Anthony Joshua, you know, I think people need to understand there's weight classes for a reason instead of just thinking that, hey, I can fight this guy regardless of how big I am or small I am compared to how big this guy is. You know, I, I'm, you know, people should understand the reality of what they're talking about. They should. Because I, I, I feel that Ryan, you know, is in a fantasy fairy tale world at times. Yo, yeah, I, yeah, I can whoop AJ, man. I, I, I'm, I can't wait to fight AJ. I'm like, what makes you think AJ would want to fight you? And what makes you think that you could get a fight with AJ? AJ, if he knocks out Danny Dubois, is fighting for the undisputed heavyweight championship of the world. And that's that's against whoever wins between Tyson Fury and uh, Usyk. Again, two other fighters that he's never called out. But it's AJ. Maybe he looks at AJ, you know, profitable. Maybe he looks at him like he could take him based on his style. But I can tell you, if Anthony Joshua hits, hits uh, Ryan Garcia anywhere, it's going to be like, a bigger guy beating up a smaller guy and it will look bullyish. It will look sad. And a lot of people will probably get mad because it's like, well, why would, did you do the kid like that? Well, he came up and he charged me, he challenged me, and he tried to bring it to me with those sporadic shots. So I caught him with a shot and knocked him spark out just like Canelo did Amir Khan. That's how I see a fight like that realistically going, you know, AJ just catching him with one of those shots. He's trying to, he's trying to time it with that left hook and stuff like that. And he gets caught and knocked out cold. <laughs>
But you guys tell me what you think of Ryan Garcia once again stating that he can't wait to fight AJ. He's moving the heavyweight to fight AJ. And AJ got, already got beat by a younger or should I say a smaller guy. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been Counterpunch. Peace.